Uh, we are currently at the center of California, as you can see on the sign behind me. We're going to go on a 100-mile uh, trip, uh, get some nice views, maybe do a little bit of hiking, and provide you guys with how beautiful California is. So we have a quick stop here at Redinger uh, Lake. It's uh, 3,600 feet, uh, 8.5 miles from North Fort. It's an amazing view. Uh, I could say it, you could probably see it on a video, but it's not going to do it any justice unless you're actually here. Uh, it's got a nice bench here that you can sit on uh, and just enjoy the view. It's just amazing. So they built this cabin in 1860. Mm -hmm. It was documented on the earliest land surveys. He came here from Missouri 10 years earlier to avoid the conflicts of the coming Civil War and to try his luck at prospecting for gold. A mono Indian woman named Mary Waspy and the people of her village helped Ross to survive and thrive in their land. Mm -hmm. And this was built in 1860. 1860. Yeah. Wow. So originally this cabin was located half a mile north of this spot. To save it from de demolition, the private owners donated the cabin to the Sierra National Forest. In 1990, the cabin was moved to this location on public land where volunteers and Forest Service employees renovated it to the style of its pioneer era. So we got here at the Whiskey Falls and it's really beautiful here, really beautiful. We got the falls to ourselves. This is amazing, really amazing. I love it. So, is it worth it? Yeah. It's worth it. Do you like it? Yeah. It was a long, bumpy road, but hey, look at it. So hopefully on the way out, it's a lot smoother. <laughs> Mile High Vista Point. Uh, I wonder what it's called Mile High. I don't know if it's Vista Mile High. <laughs> I'm just kidding. So here we go. 15 mountain peaks over 10,000 feet. Dang. And you can even see Mammoth Mountain, at, which is at 13,157 feet. So it's, it's really amazing view. Like far, far, far. Yeah. Next stop is going to be the Arch Rock. Uh, we saw the sign. We actually passed it up and turned around, and then seen the sign for it. Yeah, you can easily miss it. Yeah. You can see uh, what it's mother pretty cool. yeah what mother nature does so from the water flowing underneath correct mm, let's go it's on to the next stop mm -hmm. Stop, we decided to go see the Jackass Metal. It's 
just above 7,000 feet. We wanted to check it out. It's got a really nice uh, walkway to it. It's very popular for the uh, John Muir Trail. And if you're lucky or unlucky, you might be able to see a bear. But uh, supposedly there's a lot of bears here and wildlife. next stop all right so for our next quick stop is the globe rock yeah. so it's a balance rock it can roll anytime it's the one that's cool uh, lego let's go look at it oh wow <laughs> Ooh, it's actually big that's cool We tried to go see the uh, the well-known Jones store. It's famous for its tri-tip and uh, pies. Unfortunately, when we got there, uh, they completely ran out by like lunchtime. So it was really busy there, uh, really cool. There's no electricity there. And just a uh, disclaimer, they don't allow uh, photography or videography inside the store itself. So just enjoy the meals, enjoy the atmosphere, and that's how they like it. So we're going to the first Dome. Hi. Hello. Ready? Yeah. Lego. Let's go. Oh my god, it's so windy. Yeah, the, the one day trip, it turned into a two day trip. Yeah, but luckily we prepared for it this time. We brought the, the tent, the tent and food. We food. And, yeah, so we were prepared in case we had to stay the night. But we tried to make the Nelders Grove yeah. as our like final stop. Yeah, Unfortunately, it was, it was already dark when we got there. Yeah, it was and way too late. <laughs> it was uh, already like past 8 p.m. and the sun was already starting to go down this trip wasn't too bad no. it's, it, it turned out to be it was, actu it was actually uh the trails that we end up having to go on the three hour extra worth of trips for it service has road. amazing views amazing views and it definitely tested out our truck as well to exactly. see how well it would perform <laughs> it tested my patience it Test tested the yeah. truck <laughs> <laughs> if you have to choose one stop from all of the things that we check in this area what's your pick i would have to go with the fresno dome it's a really amazing right yeah fresno dome was definitely worth the trip worth the hike and it's pretty much a view that you won't see from much any other places